Several years ago, I made a video on higher differentials in physics, including things like acceleration, jerk, snap, crackle, and pop. Right away, people requested a video about apismant. Well, it's nearly seven years later, and I'm finally making that video. If we integrate acceleration with respect to time, the results is velocity. Integrating velocity results in displacement. But what if we integrate displacement with respect to time? That is apismant. The term comes from a combination of absence and displacement. But what even is absent? Well, the simplest way I can explain it is to picture a ball some distance away from an origin. Let's graph the displacement versus time as the ball moves closer and further away. The area under this graph is absent. Imagine a spring that can be strained from its initial position. If it's strained enough, it can cause the spring to warp. The strain that a spring feels depends on two things how far the spring is displaced, and for how long. For example, a spring that is stretched only a couple inches for a week may warp more than a spring that is stretched further for only a few minutes. The absent of the spring is directly related to the total strain. In the same way we integrated displacement, we could also integrate absent with respect to time. This will give us absidy, acceleration, absurk, absnap, absackle, and absop. Thank you for watching and if there's anything else you'd like me to discuss, I'll try not to wait seven years this time.